Go chase one. Mm -mm. Hello, my name is Anaya Harris, and I'm the Chief Executive Officer at Buholz High School, located in Gainesville, Florida. Hi, my name is Nahum Fesahaya, and I'm the Chief Operating Officer at Buholz High School. At Buholz, we operate a school-based enterprise known as the Spirit Spot. The Spirit Spot is located in the Academy of Entrepreneurship, right in front of one of Buholz's uh, picnic areas. Upon entering the Spirit Spot, you are met with the apparel shop on the left-hand side and the cafe on the right. In the cafe, we serve uh, school lunch, warm school lunch items such as chicken sandwiches, chicken poppers, and curly fries. In addition to these items, we also offer a multitude of different snacks as well. Uh, in our apparel shop, we offer a variety of Buholz themed apparel and accessories and we also offer school supplies as well. One factor that has impacted our business as a whole is our location. Most of our customers are students and teachers because we are located at school. Some parents do shop with us as well and they hear about us by visiting school or reading about us in the school newsletter. This year, four different aspects have affected our market plan. The first one is our target market which is made up mainly of students and staff who are proud of the school. But this year, it was a challenge reaching out to students who are online versus in-person school. The second thing that affected our marketing plan was our means of promoting. We use social media, mainly Instagram, to promote our Decadog Wednesdays and different um, sales we're having at school. We also create our own commercials, which are then showed on our morning announcements so the students that are at school can know what sales and what we're doing at the Spirit Spot during that week or month. Um, online students get to know about those things through our newsletters. And we also create surveys that we have customers fill out as they come in and out of the Spirit Spot. The third factor is COVID. COVID made us rethink our whole operation by having to limit the amount of students we allow inside of the Spirit Spot. We moved our cafe register to the window so we could take orders from the outside and not allow so many people inside of the store. And this year, our last one is our limited food items. We receive cafeteria lunches, but due to their shortened menu and the fact that all Buho students now receive free lunch, it was harder for us to get students to come by our school lunches as a whole. So. We had to open up early in the morning and offer different snacks such as Pop-Tarts, honey buns, different drinks and things like that to get the students through the day. Due to COVID-19, our inventory from the cafeteria was cut short. We went from having almost nine uh, different warm lunch options to only three. Uh, because of this, we were forced to come up with another way to earn uh, those funds lost from that. So we decided to purchase the a, a grill for the Academy of Entrepreneurship. And the grill makes our signature Deca dogs, which are served every other Wednesday. And this is a great investment uh, because it allows our SBE to keep 100% of the profits and also making up for the lack of money brought in from the cafeteria lunches as well. Uh, so we also, since we uh, now have the hours in the morning, we made another item to sell, which is iced coffees. Now that we offer iced coffees, it is very convenient since we also have the window. It allows for students to just come by, quickly order, and quickly be served on their way to their first period class. So we definitely expect these innovations to have a lasting impact on, on our uh, SPE uh, as a whole. Thank you for listening. We appreciate your time. Have a good day. Thank you. Damn, I stopped recording. <laughs> I don't do when I want